is up in the army. I am Gaming Air, Gaming Air 5 coming at you with a brand new video. And, and today I am going to be unboxing and building and reviewing the Lego Star Wars Stormtrooper Helmet. This is the smallest of the three Lego Star Wars collectors. Uh, a helmet or head collection. Uh, it, I've built Boba Fett. I built that one in August. I built uh, the Tie Fighter, which you saw on the weekend, and now I'm building this one. There is also Iron Man from the Marvel from Marvel. So, and that'll be built uh, tomorrow. You guys will see that tomorrow. So wait, that. So take a look at this. So. On the front, just like all the others, we have the pick, the the actual head. I moved this so that I could record videos and have better audio for you guys. <laughs> but now that I'm building in here, <laughs> it was quickie. Anyway, with that, on the front we have the head, we have the stormtrooper, we have the amount of pieces, set number, age, Star Wars Lego logo, things. This set is 75276, it is for 18 plus, just like the others, and it has 647 pieces, and the TIE Fighter Pilot had 724 pieces, and I have a feeling I know why it's such a big difference on the TIE Fighter Pilot. The TIE Fighter Pilot has the, uh, tubes, those were a lot, and this one, I can already tell has stickers on it. Which really annoys me. But, um, on the sides, pretty much nothing. Well, on this side, it has 40 years of the Empire Strikes Back. This was released for. It has another picture of the Stormtrooper helmet, the Star Lego Star Wars logo. This side, nothing. Then on the back, you get to see uh, kind of a diagram of it. Length and size of it is 18 centimeters tall. Uh, then you get to see it in the film, a picture of it from the film. So, yeah. I don't remember the Stormtrooper having blue lines on the helmet in the film, though. But that could just be me. I'm pretty sure that was only in Rebels. But anyway, with that, uh, let's get this open and let's see what's inside it. I hate these push tabs. As I suck at them. There we go. I don't remember that one having. No, that one didn't have them. Did it? No. That, this one must be small enough to not need them. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, fun times. I still have all the boxes from all the sets that I can build. Anyway. Uh, we have, wow, five stickers, that's annoying, and, uh, then how many bags do we got? Well, bag two's already ripped. <laughs> There's bag five, four, one, and three. There is a total of five bags, one instruction books. Not that thick. And, uh, yeah, so one, two, three, four, five. And two has a hole in it. Okay. It's 
not that big of a hole that stuff would fit through it, but still, there's a hole. I think. I think there was a hole. Yeah, there's a hole. Yeah, nothing's, nothing's gonna fit through that because there's another bag inside. Anyway, with that, let's get up to building. Simple. <laughs>
that, the Stormtrooper is done. Man, this thing was actually quite easy to build, especially when you know how to do the next p the, the what after you do the one side is pretty easy to do the other side. I got the other side in record timing done, and uh, I really like the look of this thing. It is so cool, but honestly, this is out of the three that I built. This one's like right right at the top with the other two. Like, this one is super cool. I really like this. We'll see how Iron Man looks. I think that one might be my favorite. It looks like it's going to be quite, quite, um, quite cool looking. But I really like the look of this set. It is amazing. It is so cool. It is probably the coolest set I've ever built. And, um, other than the Razor Crest. Out of the heads, this is one of the coolest. Um, but, in my view, the only way to fully see how it looks is to put it with the other two on my, uh, dresser in my bedroom. So, let's, uh, I will cut here, and I will be putting this guy right in the same spot as the others, right next to the TIE fighter pilot. Okay, so, I'm in my bedroom. Hello! <laughs> That's the TIE Fighter Pilot and Boba Fett. And... Here is the Stormtrooper. It is super cool looking. And, uh, yeah. Honestly, it's not actually quite diff- It's not that different, the front. How the front is built. It's not that different than, uh, the, um, TIE Fighter, but, obviously, let's just place him right there, and now, all three heads are right next to each other. Let's, uh, bring you closer. Ta-da! All three heads together at last. It They look so cool next to each other. Out of all three of these, I definitely will say the TIE Fighter is definitely my, the coolest. But I think second will be the Stormtrooper. It has so much detail on it. Yes, Boba Fett has a lot of detail also. But I think the Stormtrooper has more. So I think... I'm gonna have to say the Stormtrooper looks cooler than uh, Boba Fett and uh, Tire Fighter Pilot is uh, my cool the coolest one I have. But with that, guys. Eh. Hello. How are you? Hi. Um. With that, I'm Gaming Gaminator Five from the Army Team. Sign off. I hope to see you all in the next video. And uh, yeah. Goodbye. Iron Man's next! Woo!